This one is a question we get all the time. Calls, emails, Facebook messages, tweets. Are other cities giving homeless people bus tickets to Spokane? It's a common talking point in our broader conversation about homelessness. So, is it true? Is that really happening? To find out, we talked to people working with the homeless in Portland, Seattle, and Spokane. Here's what we learned. In Portland, a busing program exists. It's called Ticket Home. And every year, they give out a few hundred bus, train, or plane tickets to homeless people. In order to get a ticket, people have to prove they'll have a place to live in their new city. Although, as an investigation by our sister station in Portland found, they often end up back on the streets anyway. Regardless of the hundreds of tickets given out in Portland, only three were for Spokane. Multnomah County says one Spokane ticket was given out in 2016, 17, and 18, and zero in 2019. In Seattle, many of the homelessness services are run by the Compass Housing Alliance. They too have a ticket program. They told us, quote, on occasion, should we have the funding available, we can offer a bus ticket to someone who is reconnecting with family who can help support them, or an offer for employment. But they didn't have numbers on how many tickets they've provided or whether any were to Spokane. Now, obviously, there are more cities than just Portland and Seattle, but a lengthy investigation by The Guardian estimates that over the last decade, only about 50 people got bus tickets to Spokane. Meanwhile, Spokane's own point in time count shows that the vast majority of people on the streets here are from here. And Catholic Charities Eastern Washington tells us 80 to 85% of the people they serve are from within 75 miles of Spokane. So, are cities giving homeless people bus tickets to Spokane? Yes, that we can verify. But are the recipients of those tickets a significant portion of our city's homeless? No, they're not. For Creme 2 News, I'm Casey Decker.